We had to come back, and as we were coming back, that's how we ended up under the bridge. Sirens are going off here in town, guys. Hear the sirens? This is serious. This is it, guys. Yeah, there it is. Look to the left. Uh, I got it. Hey, confirmation on the walkout. What do you want to do? We may put up shop real close here. Pull over to the side. My first thoughts uh, were, how can we keep all the people safe that we brought into the situation? How can we keep the people safe that have come with us and also the people that we're stopping? Either one of those two spots, either that spot or that spot. There it goes, it's coming down, it's reaching down. At that point, I wanted to run. I think uh, uh, even though I realize what you're supposed to do, uh, you're safe up underneath the bridge, I really was scared. Then down. the explorer and me wanted to stay there and see what was gonna happen next. It's halfway down, we can't tell from here if there's if there's debris, but it's it's halfway down. Big funnel, it's, it's getting larger, it's much larger. There's debris, debris, see the ground? Man, we are right in it. That is the tornado. Oh yeah, look at it. Off to the left side. Lots of debris on the ground. It's coming right at us. It's coming right this way, guys. We're gonna try to take cover up here. This thing is gonna come right at us. No, it's coming right this way. It's, it's trailing behind the major thunderstorm to the right. This has got major debris on the ground. This thing is doing, this thing is gonna do big damage. Let's go down to that ditch, but still take, keep an eye on it. It's passing, there's debris on the ground. It's, it's passing over 30. really didn't want to be that close. We didn't expect it to take a right-hand turn. I thought that it would travel maybe a mile away from us. And instead, when it hit the freeway, it took a right-hand turn right down the freeway. A car! Car just got hit. Car just got flipped over. Get down, guys. Everybody get down. Get down. Don't look. Lay as flat as possible. Don't let any air get underneath you. Be careful, guys, because the inflow winds can get really strong, even close to this thing. Listen to the squealing. You hear the sound? Here it comes. Hang on, you guys. Hang on, you guys. Hang on, you guys. Oh, my God. Dear God, we're in trouble. We're in trouble, folks. It wasn't like I imagined it to be. Um, you hear about it sounding like a freight train. Well, actually, it sounded like a bunch of squealing pigs. And it's just like the wind is getting sucked out of everything, and that squealing sound was very uh, scary. Yeah, it's past us. It's past us. We're fine. Okay. If I had to do it again, I would try not to be out ahead of the storm. I'd try to make sure that we were south of it or behind it, and I wouldn't be that close. I captured tornadoes three times, which um, I feel is a good good average, and it might be a time to, to call it quits, um, because I don't think I'll ever get closer than the storm that we had under the bridge. This same storm complex affected the life of another weather professional, a storm